The point is, you gotta hang in there long enough to win if it's worth hanging in there for. Now, I don't want you to walk away say, say, saying that that's the only thing I remember what this guy said. Let's recap. Four things. If we want to be effective leaders, we've got to have effective followers. People depend upon us to be the very best that we can in the job that we've chosen to do. There are four areas that we talked about is following the do-right rule, having integrity. Because if we can't have integrity, we can't develop trust. If we don't develop trust, we can't develop people. If we don't develop people, we won't have any followers. If we don't have any followers, we're not leading anybody anyway. So it all begins with doing right. Understanding what is the right thing to do and making that decision to stick by that regardless of the situation. Second thing is to escape from management land. It's to get in touch with our people and understand that they have basic communication needs. They need to know what's required. They need to know how they're doing. They need to know does anybody care. They need to know how that team is doing. They also need to know where it all fits in. Third thing is to hire tough. Hire tough. Make it an honor to get on your team so that you can manage easy. Don't hire easy so that you can manage tough. Last thing is to work faster, is to be more efficient and better at what you've done, what you're doing, so that you have more time to spend developing people as opposed to, to filling out paperwork. You see this thing that we've talked about uh, over the last 30 minutes is about leadership. And leadership is not something that you can claim like you do a, uh, your luggage at an airport. It's not something that you can buy because there's nobody selling it. There's no way to sell it. It's not something that you can manufacture because there's no manufacturing plants that do it. It's not something that you can take some, from someone that even wants to give it to you. You see, leadership is earned. And it's earned by doing all the things that you've talked about over these last two and a half days and being the type of leader that you want to be. And so whether you came in here this evening as a prisoner or whether you came as a vacationer or whether you came as a student or whether you came as a graduate, I hope that you'll walk away with one or two or three or four or five things that will help make you more effective with the people dependent upon you back home. Thank you very much.